Hey, hello everybody, welcome to the sound test room. Today, we're going to take a look at Orbulator. Orbulator. Right, so, this is a new sort of touch synth uh, that's come out. That at the moment, doesn't have uh, audio bus compatibility, but uh, the developer, uh, Mark Carlotto, who's brought us lots of other stuff, like Uber synth and things like that, are really good, uh, is going to add audio bus compatibility, I'm pretty sure. So, okay, so let's have a take what it does. It plays using these orbs, if you like. And we can show the notes that the orbs represent by hitting this little show button here. And we can adjust certain things the way the X and Y ratio works. Now, the sound is made up of four different sounds which we can see here so if I take this one out here and this one out here and this one out here we're left with sine bass and if we take that out and put that one in then we can mix this one in and then if we select that one and then select uh, settings these are the sound patches that are already programmed in, so we could change that one to, say, Elastic Band. And we can sample it by touching it like that. And some of these are a bit quiet. I'm sorry, guys. Okay, so let's just uh, go back there to play. Mix that in a bit more. And put Bell back in. we go to here what says synth we can see the different parameters that are set like octave shift decay for each of these separate things so elastic band which is there now okay and then we can go we can go and play. So let's just head on over to settings again and let's have a look at some of the other things we can do. Now we can set the scale, which is very useful. We have all these scales to choose from and then we can tone up uh, the semitone. So say we wanted to, if we were in D and we wanted to be in C, we could go down two semitones. So we'd be there or one whole tone if you like. Okay, so let's just uh, select another scale there, play. Plus also it's polyphonic. We can change out some of these sounds because they sound uh, that don't don't feel right there. So if we try that one, that's better. And we'll see. too much delay so we can take our delay off go back to play so there you go you get the idea it's got a great synth so you can adjust everything you can play with it um, change all the scales and everything and uh, once it gets audio bus I think it'd be quite useful it's not going to be for everybody like you know but for people to play around with and have some fun with mixing the different sounds and of course altering the different sounds as well quite good when we can make it sounds quite juicy let's lower the octaves actually let's hide the octave on the theremin drop the volume down a little and drop that one or oh, and again like i said we can change the scales so there you go guys that was a quick look at orbulator I'll see you later.